Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how we can import our research notes or any kind of draft writing that we have from Evernote into our Scrivener writing environment. And this can be done without having to copy and paste anything in between the two programs. So let's get started. So as you can see here, I have my Scrivener opened here. And this is a brand new writing project without anything at all here except the basic structure that you can see here. So I want to add some content here directly from Evernote. How can I do it? So let's, let me open up Evernote here. So this is my first notebook here you can see. And there are three notes here so far in the first notebook. So suppose I would like to import this note as the uh, content part, as part of the content in the in my Scrivener project. So of course you would say, oh, this is so short. Of course I can just copy this. Uh, choose select the whole thing. Select the whole thing, and then just paste it directly into my Scrivener project. Add a f new text, for example, like that, and then I can just basically copy and paste it here, like just like that. Well, if the text is short, uh, you can do it, of course, without any kind of problem. As you can see, um, the other files that I have here in Evernote has some, uh, has more words. It's much longer than that. So let's say I would like to import this one uh, note into Scrivener. So let's di directly import this file into Scrivener. So the first thing I would need to do is um, right click on the note and then choose export note. And there are four fo file formats that I have to choose from. Remember to choose the second one, export as a single HTML web page dot HTML file. So choose export this and then I'll save it here on my desktop. It says there's a file with the same name uh, existing there already because I just created one early, uh, a moment ago, but let's o override that. So now it says export uh, succeeded. So let's close it. And let's switch back to my Scrivener project. So now uh, let's choose the draft here in the binder and right click on it, add. Now rem a little bit of trick here uh, when you add the file uh, is you do not add it as a web page. You Although you save it as a .html file, you, you choose add files and not add a web page because if you choose to add to add a web page it will ask you to give it a URL which is not what you just created so anyway I choose add files and now here I find my file here MAT so as the uh, exam essay and this is a preview of the file of all the words here all the text open and so it says converting file. So it may take a little bit of time for it to be completely converted into Scrivener. So let's wait for the conversion to complete. So it's a little longer, but if your file is really long, if you have a really long uh, note in Evernote, this is a more sure file way to ensure that the file is um, going to be uh, lossless. So now it's completed. And as you can see, this is a new card that's created, new in the in the cardboard. And this text here in the editor is imported exactly word for word from uh, Evernote. So this is how you can interconnect your Evernote 
and a Scrivener. And this is really convenient. I hope this will be helpful to you. And thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye.